All right, so look, I got five plugins for you that I use all the time. Like I'm telling you, these are my go-to plugins. You gotta have them and they are absolutely free. For real, let's go. All right, so I wanna talk about five plugins, my go-to plugins that are free and I use a lot fairly often. And you might've seen them in some of my videos in the past, but I wanna mention them, talk about them a little bit and you know, just demonstrate and show you exactly what they are capable of doing. They are free, like I said, I will not, will not say it again. I might say it again, who knows, but they're free and you know, I'll leave all that stuff in the description, the links, all that good stuff so you can access these plugins, okay? So first plugin I wanna talk about today is MT Power Drum Kit 2. You already know, man, like MT Power Drum Kit 2 by Manda Audio. This plugin is great for like, you know, Rick Ross type beats, J. Cole type beats, like, like you know, chill, like boom bat, that kind of vibe is really, really dope. All right, so I have this really cool song pulled up, it's chill. It's like a J. Cole type beat for sure. This joint is crazy. Here's some of the sounds from it. That joint is crazy. I love the way that sounds, like the hi-hats with the open hat. It just goes really well with a, you know, a beat like this. It's a, it's a super dope plug-in. I don't use all this stuff, like the drums and stuff. Sometimes I use them, sometimes I won't. Sometimes I just use the hi-hats like, like I demonstrated in this beat. All right, so the next plugin I wanna talk about is Glitch 1.3. Okay, I'm not sure who the owner is. It's unknown. Uh, I couldn't find who it was, who made it, but shouts out to whoever made Glitch 1.3. Super dope. I know there's a Glitch 2 out as well, and it may be the same owner, but Glitch 1.3 is the one that I have. All right, so let's go ahead and pull in a, a track, or pull in some melodies. I'm gonna go right to my MIDI pack uh, that me and the bros put together. It's called Antidote. I'll leave that in the description as well. And how, how it's set up, it's very simple. Uh, it's actually kind of confusing at first, but once you realize, you know, once I explain it, it's not that hard, I promise you. So originally you got the white keys, this, this, it's the random, this is a random, so R is a random, it's white, it's just a random, it'll insert a random, one of these nine effects in each section, so boom. It's just random, and it can, honestly, that kind of can be cool, but I never really use it. So, what I'm gonna do is just click the gray one, which is clear, and just click on the left side of your key, of your, of your mouse, so left click it, boom, right? Don't right click, because it'll just erase it. If you right click, if you if you right click, it's only gonna erase. If you left click, it's gonna create that that mark for you. You know what I'm saying? So I like to do this because it likes I like to keep it organized and know what, what's next for me to input. So now it's blank, we hit play. Nothing's gonna happen, right? Smooth. Hey. Hey. So it's smooth. Let's go ahead and add some effects to it. Pretty cool, right? I like that. Let's go ahead and add some drums to it just real quick and have a little beat going on with it, so. That's crazy, love that plugin, love that plugin. If you don't already have it, go ahead and make that move. Glitch 1.3. All right, so the next plugin I wanna talk about is one of my favorite just synthesizers. This is a great plugin. It is called Triple Cheese by UHE. This plugin is crazy. All right, let's find a cool sound. And we can just go here, go to the drop down. We could do vocal pad. Ooh, man, that's crazy. All right, so the next plugin that I want to talk about is called Gorilla Bass. This plugin is super dope and it is by Sample Science. This is a cool plugin, another synthesizer, synth bass plugin. I'm sure you probably assumed that from the name, but I'm telling you, this plugin is dope. Yeah, it's crazy. So, the last plugin, the last and final plugin that I want to discuss today, that I want to talk about today is Pancake 2. 
by the cable guys. This plugin, I'm telling you, I just copped it not too long ago. I found out from another producer, he had mentioned it, and I was like, yo, this plugin, let me check it out. Let's go ahead and throw in Pancake plugin on this hi-hat. Now, you could throw this on your melodies too, you could throw this on anything you want, get creative with it. Honestly, I would just have fun with it on every bar, every one eighth, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Yo, the beat is crazy. Shouts out to the free plugins. I'm telling you, these plugins are amazing. As you can tell, have you you've already heard what they can do. You know what I'm saying? So tap in. Just 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 lock in as soon as you possibly can, okay? Before you leave, don't roll anywhere, don't go anywhere. Check out this video that me and the bro Andrew put together. Man, this is such a great video. It was really creative. Shouts out to Andrew on his behalf for coming up with this idea. FL Studio versus Studio One. All right, go check it out. I'll leave it right here and in the description below. Other than that, we'll see you in the next one. Peace.